That's all I'm trying to say. Savannah, I'm coming home. Savannah. Well, hello there. And we are back with another hair review, okay? Um, you see what I'm saying? We gonna do the do. Okay, so today's hair is, oh, I'm just unorganized. Y'all already know how I do. I don't know why when I turn on the camera, I'm just <laughs> a hot mess, but we gonna get through it. So today's hair is from Hair Vivi, or Hair, what is that, 6655? Six, six, five, five. Oh, listen, I ain't good with all that, okay? Listen, okay, it is what it is, what it is. Okay, I'm gonna say Vivi. Hair Vivi, okay? This box is so pretty. Like, I don't know what I'm gonna do with this. I feel like I'm gonna put some goodies in here and give them to my my niece-in-law. Is that what you call them? I mean, she my niece. Listen, I'm gonna give it to my niece, okay? I'm gonna put some little nail polishes and some stuff. You know what I'm saying? Upcycle, do to do, okay? But anyway, so I have this ombre hair. It is 18 inches and she is bomb okay i'm gonna go through real quick they have they bleach the knots and they put in a fake scalp like <laughs> i'm gonna stop accepting wigs without the fake scalp okay this is where we need to take it like i'm just in love with that as you can tell there is an elastic band in there for adjustment they also gave me an extra elastic band i guess if one gets stretched out or whatever you can just switch it out and like it's just bomb okay and you got it's just a regular standard wig you know what i'm saying doing the do whoop de whoop i'm gonna go over and give her some curls she is ombre she is 18 inches um okay i'm gonna show you the goodies that i got in the box because i was really appreciative of you know what i'm saying some good goodies so first things first i got a comb little rat tail comb now I'm, i do not know if they're going to be giving all like this you know what i'm saying like if every package is gonna be the same, I do not know, okay? But more than likely, they are. You get two clips, two good, firm, sturdy clips. And <laughs> I'm in love, okay? Like, the more edge control brushes you have, you cannot go wrong, okay? I promise you. Okay, so um, first things first, before we even go any further, you know I got to shout out to my peoples, okay? So let me go ahead into my phone and do that. Okay, so first we have I'm gonna butcher your name. I am so sorry, okay? So, Snothile, Snothile Mismele, Mismela. Miz, you, okay? Thank you, baby, <laughs> for getting here first, okay? Miss Nell, come on in. Gabrielle, Ariza, Beverly Ray, and Pakie Nojomba, Nojomba, Jomba. Okay, to all five of y'all, thank you for making it here first. I can't wait to see who is gonna be first on this video so I can shout you out on the next video. You see what I'm saying? Anyways, we are going to go in with this little bad boy right here. So what I'm gonna do, the knots are already bleached. Look at the parting space. Like, <laughs> look at that. Everything is plug in and nothing to plug out. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go go ahead off camera and I'm gonna cut the lace off and we're gonna come on back and apply it together. I always cut the lace off. I have tried sticking it down <laughs> with the lace on it and then cutting it like mm, I ain't got to, no, I ain't got time for that. Okay. Now the strap is kind of like a bra strap, you know, like up here where you adjust it. So I really, really like that. And you still have the actual straps in the back here that you can like hook in here so she just bomb like she just doing it for me okay so let's put her on and see what's going on boo okay i feel like i might need to clean up around my edges because i already have my makeup done but and i'm not going to be putting a cap under this because like i said she already has the actual fake scalp oh she fits nice and that's without adjusting okay <laughs> She can definitely be worn glueless. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is, I'm just gonna show you on this wig how I actually do my glueless wigs. I changed my mind. So first things first, what you wanna do is comb all the hair back because the way she's fitting on me, she's not covering my sides enough. So I'm just gonna turn her into a full glueless wig. We are not gonna stick her down at all. And then later on, I'm gonna just go in and mold some baby hairs. Okay, so first things first, 
and I'm gonna use the comb that they sent me because I love a good rat tail comb. This has a little metal on the end. So first things first, what you wanna do is, so right here is where all the tension is. You kinda wanna keep that, okay? What you wanna do is exactly where that tension is, you just go right in and kinda like, you can feel it where the tension is on the side because of where the actual, whatchamacallit is, the elastic band, basically. And part out that hair, and then we're gonna cut all of that off. So once you remove this, you're still gonna have that tension and it's gonna lay a lot tighter on the head and you won't have to worry about these flaps lifting because there's no tension on this. That's basically all that is about. So it's very, very easy. So if you even have like a regular wig that you've made, and you have all that extra sideburns, but you kind of want to turn it into a everyday type of joint. Like you can just throw it on and go. You see what I'm saying? Like it lays flat. Okay, and I'm gonna show you how to fix all of this. And now I'm gonna do the same thing to the other side. When I get wigs and they don't like fit 100%, that's what I do. I just turn it into an everyday wig. So you see how it lays a lot flatter. So I'm gonna show you exactly what I like to do. So I'm gonna take this back off because I have to mold my sides and you're gonna see all of that. Okay, so going back in with my ebon and I'm also gonna be using the little <laughs> thingamajiggy. Okay, because I find that with edge brushes, the fresher the brush, like the cleaner the brush, the better. Oh, it has the little hair low and everything on it. I didn't even see that. So we're just gonna pull out some of the sideburns basically. And we're gonna just tie this part down. The rest of it you don't have to really worry about. Once you have this part looking nice, you're gonna see how bomb it looks. Look how that laid everything. And then I'm gonna spray some guts to be. You can do a little bit on the um up here as well. You don't wanna go up here because you're gonna do different. You're gonna have actual baby hairs from the actual unit. So you just wanna do like very, very light situations right here super light now that I have that I'm gonna go in with my guts to be and my little head tie and we're gonna kind of freeze them into place now this technically works for me I don't have a problem with this like this just you know it works okay so trust and believe shake it up Ooh. Ooh. freeze it up Ooh. yes Ooh. catch some of that Okay. and just tie around your ears basically so get your blow dryer we're gonna go in on hot and cold hot and cold you just kind of flash it so first hot and then we're gonna cool it down okay Okay, ready or not, here I come. Okay, we gonna take this off because like I said, we trying to get through this video, shall we? I'm not here. Okay, Oof. Yes, they are dry, okay? Now that's gonna stay like that. That is not gonna move, I promise you. If you got trouble with your edges, try this. I don't know if my hair is 4D, 35C, double D, listen, okay, I don't know nothing about them numbers. I see them, I don't, I haven't even gotten into that. I don't know what texture my hair is, but this works. Okay, so go ahead and try it. Let's go back into this wig. We're also gonna be doing baby hairs on this because I love baby hairs. If you don't like baby hairs, you can just take what you need from this and move along, okay? You don't have to do baby hairs, okay? But don't come for me because I like mine. That's all I'm trying to say. Look at how she's laying already. You just wanna brush back all of this stuff right here and you wanna take out your baby hairs from now. Cause this is how we gonna get down, okay? Take them out, take them out. Okay, so I'm gonna get my mousse. I'm gonna tie this back up once again. Okay, first things first, let's get the back up because Okay, so what I'm gonna do is I have a little dish in front of me, so I'm gonna spray some of the mousse out on the dish and not on my actual hairline. That way I have a lot more control over it. Okay, with my little brush. And we're gonna mold these baby hairs into place. 
get them going then we're going to tie them down basically Okay, so I'm gonna leave that even longer and deal with that afterwards So what we're gonna do is just go in and give her some curls just bump her up a little bit The great thing about these everyday wigs too is like they're easy to curl like once I go back and put the bundles and all of that Like the, how I really want it. I'm here forever and I would never ever 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 do this on My head I would take it off and I would put it on the mannequin and then I would deal with it. These clips are actually really nice. <laughs> okay, but for this type of thing, and I have my barrel. I think this is, what is this? I don't know. I don't know what inch this is. One and a half. Lonesome dripping, cause we're spending the night. And it feels alright, but it's over now. Time keeps slipping, with the skin next to mine. Okay, so from here, that's basically it. So as you can tell, like if the wind blows, it'll still look a lot better than if nothing was going on. You see what I'm saying? Because you have your edges right there. Now from here, what we're gonna do is just comb these out. Make them a little soft, that's all. And like I said, from this part right here, like once you have this, you take this off and you put it on, like you see what I'm saying? Like you're ready to go. You don't have to do anything. Cause there's nothing like, you see what I'm saying? Like it moves, it, you see what I'm saying? Like. You get what I'm saying? So that's all you need to do. Okay, so pulling back the hair, this step is going to make or break your wig, basically. I've already done this side, so I'm gonna show you how I do this side. So right where you would like for your baby hairs to kind of come out, you know, like you have you have here and then you have here, basically. I'm trying to explain this to the best of my ability, y'all. Okay, so basically where you want to start swooping, okay? So you see you have all of this back here. We're gonna hide that, and we're gonna hide that with this one piece right here. That's why I didn't cut all of this. So we're just gonna part this down. We're gonna put some bang, put some bang. Okay, and this is what makes this magical okay what you're gonna do is go in and basically like hold it to where your the top of your ear is i hope i'm making sense to y'all i promise you it works okay you're gonna see so from here what we're gonna do is basically layer it a little bit high and we're just gonna kind of layer it why did i pick up the 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 dull one again see what I'm saying so it's gonna have that layered effect and when you're done with your, your unit all you do is like brush that over like that's all it is okay so if you want you can go in and mold this I don't like to mold this though I like it to look you know free <laughs> for this because all you're gonna do is literally and you do it is best with your hands is just kind of sweep it down and you see what's taking place like it's hiding that whole entire area if you want you can tuck it behind your ears but I find that you see what I'm saying like because that's this is this side and you just brush it back like that <laughs> you get what I'm saying so that little bit of hair from right here and it hides everything. So if the wind blows now, like we're good. If you wanna set that with some spray, you can definitely do that. But for the most part, it's gonna be this piece that really lifts up and this piece is gonna stay, it's gonna stay down. So listen, that's what I do, okay? For my glueless <laughs> unifications, okay? If there's a better way to do this, by all means, let me know. I'm always open to learn, okay? It's always something new out there. It's always, you see what I'm saying? So, <laughs> that 
is basically all that I do for my glueless units. I'm glad I got this out the way right here. I figured this was a good unit to do this with because I'm definitely gonna add some more hair to this and because I'm really liking how she fits and everything. You know what I'm saying? Like, who, who, you get what I'm saying? Like, okay, work with me, okay? You can't tell me that I did not share something with y'all today. It was a little hard to explain, but I think I got it out. Anyways, make sure you check out Hair Vivi, Hair Vivi, Living La Vida Loca, down in the description box. All the information will be down there for you. Um, the specs on this unit, the links to this company, the links to this hair, all of that good stuff. The hair is really, really, really beautiful if you are into everyday wigs and you just want something really light and easy and fun to go out on. She is bomb. I am loving that I have to do nothing in here. The knots are bleached. It came pre-plucked. I did nothing to it. I'm definitely gonna off camera. I'm gonna go back and um fix up them baby hairs because I, you see what I'm saying? But um, look at that. Okay, come on through. Okay, yes. Um, if it is your first time here, <laughs> please subscribe. Come on in, join the family. We are a happy bunch. Everybody is welcomed. Okay. Come on in, become a civil fox or a civil bell, whichever one you wanna be. Make sure you follow me on all of my social media platforms, which is Instagram and Snapchat and a little bit of TikTok. I'm gonna get into TikTok. I'm gonna try. Okay, I am gonna try. Um Yeah, and until the next video, take care of yourselves. I love you guys and I will see you guys really, really soon. <laughs> Turn out the lights for no reason What's it on make-believe? Something you never needed What was it all for? I don't know you